Hi, this is Tracy HD, and I'm here to do the April 2023 tarot reading for the sign of Aquarius, Sun, Moon, and Rising. And I am using my favorite tarot deck of all, the Heaven and Earth Tarot. And if you'd like to purchase this amazing deck, click the link in the description box down below. It's going to take you right to Amazon to purchase it. As I shuffle the deck, I'm asking all light beings, angels, and God, please relay the message you need to share with my viewers, the highest good of all. And for the beginning of the month, I'm going to take the top card. Middle of the month, I'm going to take a card from the center. And the end of the month, I'm going to take the bottom card. And let's see what we have here, Aqua. Well, we start out the month with a reason to celebrate. We have the Three of Cups. And they're raising their chalices up to the sky. And you may be celebrating with a small get-together. Okay? Whatever it is, there's a reason to celebrate uh, in the beginning of the month in April. And you could be surrounded by abundance. Maybe you're just feeling a sense of abundance. Or like I said, you'd be, you know, emotionally happy and maybe getting together with friends to go out with for a few drinks. You're celebrating, you know, maybe with your family. This could also indicate a wedding or christening too, because that's a form of celebration. And the cups are our emotions. Um, so this could be something that's emotionally fulfilling for you. Um, it generally, you know, tends to indicate a reason to celebrate with others in the beginning of the month. That you're feeling emotionally happy and feeling, you know, maybe a sense of achievement as well. And then in the middle of the month, we have the Three of Swords. Now, there's no need to worry about this card because this card could show up just because of something simple like feeling anxiety. You know, and we've all been there. You know, the, the world is crazy these days. I don't know anybody that doesn't experience anxiety at one point or another. This could also be just a temporary separation. And this separation could be something as simple as, you know, maybe a spouse or lover is going away on business. They have to travel for business. And it's a temporary, se you know, separation. You're feeling sorrow and sadness because of that. Or this could be a, you know, a, a squabble or, or disagreement or argument you know, with a spouse or a lover. Um, if it is a heartbreak, okay, it's temporary. This is something that you will get over. You will move on from. And if that's the case, you know, when someone leaves your life, it makes room for someone bigger and better to take its place. So whatever this is, and it's going to be different for all of you, it's a temporary situation. And then at the end of the month, here we go. We have the full there's some opportunity coming to you at the end of the month, Aquarius. This is an unexpected opportunity that's going to just drop in your lap out of nowhere. You're not even going to see it coming. Well, now you're going to see it coming because <laughs> I'm telling you it's coming. And whatever it is, you need to take that leap of faith. Do not doubt yourself. Do not say, oh, I don't have enough money to do that. Or, oh, I don't have enough education or skill to do that. Or, oh, maybe it's not the right time in my life to do something like that. No. This is an opportunity that may come only once in a lifetime, okay? Don't worry thinking, oh, you know, what if I fail? Guess what? It's never a waste of time as long as you learned something from the experience. So whether you're successful or whether you fail, you got to take this opportunity. There's going to be a chance for something. And like I said, it is going to be so unexpected. You're not going to see it coming. And Aquarius, you have this. You have this. Do not miss the opportunity because like I said, you'll be kicking yourself if this is something that maybe only happens once in a lifetime. So take that leap of faith. Wow, what an interesting month for you. If you've enjoyed this reading, I would appreciate it if you would please hit the like button to help my channel get exposure here on YouTube and to allow me to continue to bring you these messages each month. And also subscribe because I will be back with more.